Hey, welcome back to the show. This is your show for Disney tips, tricks, and how to live your best Disney life. I'm Amanda. Let's get on with the show. You're not going to say your name? Bernard. Ugh, no. This no, is Chris. that's not it. <laughs> Bernie. I'm going to call you Bernie. Bro. Oh, could I be Bernie? You want to be Bernie? Too? I might like to be Bernie. That All right, might Bernie. be fun. All right, so we are here to talk about the contemporary today. We are doing our resort series where we talk about our five favorite things at each resort at Disney World. Because Disney's closed and it's all we can think of. It's all we, we're obsessed. So we love talking about Disney resorts and Disney in general, and we're going to talk about it tonight. And that, then I have a quiz for you. What's the quiz tonight? The quiz is, what do I call it? I'm going to give you a Disney snack and you have to tell me where you find it. Oh, that's clever. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. Yeah. So where do you find the lake? All right. You have to give me the location. You'd find the snack. I like it. That's I hope you guys very clever. play along with Bernie and see how you do too. Bernard. And then if you do I don't well, go by Bernie. I go by Bernard. You do well. I got a prize. A prize for you. It's a little something little. Perfect. You know, we can't get to the stores, so I did the best I could. Hey, you know what? It takes like four weeks to get Amazon just deliveries. Yeah, so. So I had to do what I could. <laughs> All right, so what are we doing tonight? All stars? No, contemporary. Where's the contemporary? First, can we talk about our drinks? Hey, Amanda, what are you drinking there? I'm drinking a Hakuna Ma cocktail. A Hakuna Ma cocktail? Yes. Tell me more. So we made these on our other channel, Not Bad Parents. If you haven't checked out Not Bad Parents yet, make sure you do. And it's amazing. What's in it? Uh, so there's vodka, cranberry yeah. juice, orange juice, lime juice, fresh limes, champagne, and- Cherry? Uh, cherry. <laughs> and a lime. And cherry juice, and like oh maraschino God. cherry. What's not in there is the, is the question. These it's, are so good. Yeah, and so it's called the Hakuna Ma cocktail. And, and Hakuna Matata it. means no worries, and ooh, after a few of these, no worries. You certainly won't have any. Mm -mm. Mm hmm. All right, so let's get on with our. Uh, so, what are we doing? Five favorite things about the contemporary resort at Disney World. Right. And you want to start us off with number five? I could go first. All right. All right, my number five. Actually, it didn't become a number five for me yes. until our last trip. Yeah. But it's actually the gift shops there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually really like them. I didn't like them at first, but mm -hmm. I like Bayview Gifts a lot. Yeah. We found a lot of cool stuff there. Definitely. Uh, I think it's neat that they have so many places to go to. Yes, it is awesome. Mm -hmm. They have great gift shops. If you haven't checked them out yet, make sure you do. Because there are things there that you don't find at other stores, too. Yep. Yeah. And then they have a big like middle section of toys and then yes. you go over to Bayview and they have like a lot of other cool stuff to look at. Yeah, anything you could think of. Like yeah. hats. I bought a hat and a jacket. I think we all got hats and jackets. I got a spirit jersey. You got a spirit jersey and a yeah. hat. Yeah. The kids got hats. It was really fun. Yeah. Super. Yeah, I love that place. So that was my number five because I thought it was kind of neat. Yeah. All right. Um, my number five is the Contempo Cafe at um, the Contemporary. Ooh. Has some great treats and snacks and food and meals that you can get order. Um, we got cupcakes there and they were so awesome. They like were Mickey so awesome. Mickey Cupcakes. Yep. They have a great that. display for that. So Contemporary Cafe is pretty Contempo Cafe. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. What's I your like number four? My number four is the fireworks viewing from oh, yeah. below the monorail on the little observation deck. Oh yeah, I didn't I mean, think about that. I mean, if you go out there early enough, you can get a spot right up front and watch the fireworks and they pipe in the music. Oh my gosh, how did I not put that on here? I don't know. That is, yeah. But that is an amazing part of being at the Contemporary. Yeah, we got some good pictures there. Mm -hmm. I have to post them here, but we got some really good pictures of us with the castle behind us. Mm -hmm. I mean, you can't beat and it. And at night, I mean, everything's dark, and you just watch the fireworks and listen to the music, which is yeah. what I like doing. So that was my number four. I love it. My number four is the pier that walks that goes out into um, Bay Lake. Ooh. I love that. Remember mm -hmm. we walked out there, and we took some good pictures out there, too. Yeah, there's a really um, nice view. It's gorgeous. Yeah, and even looking back at the contemporary, it's like a really cool view of everything. Yeah, it's a cool little escape. Like, we really got away from the crowds going yeah. out there. It was fun. Mm -hmm. I dig it. Cool. Yeah. Well... We are moving right along. I know. What's we're your going number? really fast. What's your number three? Um, I really think that Chef Mickey's is a cool aspect mm -hmm. of being at the contemporary. Mm -hmm. Like all the cool characters that are dressed up like chefs and they come around and they hang out with you and it's a breakfast buffet. Yeah, Chef Becky's I think is that classic, when you think of buffet, um, you know, character dining at Disney, 
I think of Chef Mickey's right away. Mm -hmm. It's the classic Disney buffet meal with your kids character dining. You can't, I mean, you get the Fab Five there, right? Yep, you do. So. And they're all dressed up like chefs. Like, that's cool. Yeah, I love it. Good one. These drinks are good. I know. Uh, what was your number three? <laughs> My number three was the same as yours. Your number five. It's the stores. I mm. love the gift shops there. The BVG, which we didn't know what that meant for a while. It was the Bayview Gifts. What do we call it? Big buy 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 very, very good. good. <laughs> the buy very good store. Yeah, we always buy very good there. Mm. Um, because of our last shopping spree we went on, we had a blast. Yeah, we, we just did. went a little crazy, and we bought hats and coats, and it was just so yeah. much fun. Um, what else? Did we get like glasses there too? I think we got our shot glass there. And I think on our March trip, yeah. we did get shot glasses. Yeah. But not this time. But they really do have a great selection. And also, I really like the the um, cast members that work there. Remember the lady she had us? Yes. And it was the kid's birthday. Yes. In August. In August. Not this last trip. But in yeah. August. And the woman behind the counter had to come up and, and uh, she called... Goofy? Goofy. It was Goofy on the phone. Happy birthday to you. Oh my Happy goodness. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Happy birthday from Goofy. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. <laughs> so I hope you're having a swell time, too. And, then, and he's saying happy birthday to Yeah, it was really It neat. was really sweet. And then she gave us an uh, annual pass holder discount, too, even though oh, we're not. right. She was, like, super sweet. So she I think that just gave, made it a really good experience for me. Mm-hmm. Yeah, gift shops. They're great. Gift shops anywhere. But the contemporary are really good. I like that one a lot. Yeah. The BBG. So, number, number two. two. So, my number two is the view. Just like you said, you walk down the pier and you have all of the, the lake and you can you can see everything and it's got the boats going by and it's really neat. But I think what's even cooler is there's fireworks viewing out there at night. Yep. And also, you can view the um, the water pageant. Oh, I didn't think that. And it about goes that. right by the contemporary. That's true. Which yeah. I think is kind of neat. Yeah, you can see um, the water pageant from... Contemporary, also, the Polynesian. Wilderness Lodge, the Polynesian... And the Grand, Grand Floridian. And the Floridian. Yeah. yeah. Does it go by? It goes by Fort Wilderness, too. It does. You're right. Yeah, if you're on the beach at Fort Wilderness, you can see it, too. Sure. Yeah, which I think is kind of neat. Yeah, I love what was your number uh, two? My number two is the Mary Blair mural. I the love Mary that Blair mural. mural. I didn't even think of that, but that is a good one. Yes. As soon as you walk into um, the... Now, remember we always confused, like, we thought that that was the lobby? The monorail stop? You know, when yeah. you get off the monorail and you go Yeah, down. the first time we went, we were like, I don't get this. We didn't know there was a whole other floor that that's actually the lobby. Mm -hmm. That's, like, the fourth floor, I think, is, like, where the mural is and stuff. Yeah. Um, yeah, that mural is amazing. I think it's gorgeous. I actually really love Mary Blair. I think she's amazing. And I love trying to find the, the three-legged goat. On the mural. A five-legged goat? Oh, five-legged goat. <laughs> you like finding a goat that's not there? Yes. Wonderful. I'll keep looking. I'll never find so it. So you like finding the five-legged goat? I do. I do. I think it's fun. Cool. All right. I like it. Is this the number one? Number one. I don't know if what your number one is, but my I'm number sure one... it's the same as me. It's walking distance yes. to the Magic Kingdom. I mean, you can't beat the location. It's the only resort you can walk to the Magic Kingdom yep. from. On our last trip, we walked to Magic Kingdom twice, and it took 10 minutes. It did. It was perfect. It was the best. Yeah. So we, you know, we had a dining reservation. Make sure, you know, make a dining reservation or a breakfast reservation at Contemporary so you can just walk there. Because mm -hmm. if you prove you have a reservation, you can park there and just walk over. It's pretty awesome. It is pretty awesome. Oh. One day we will stay at the Contemporary. We haven't ever stayed there. But we will. If you have stayed there, please let us know how are the rooms. I mean, we've only we're only coming from the standpoint standpoint of being visitors to the lobby and the dining. What are the rooms like? Are they amazing? Outdated and old. You think so? I don't know. I, was looking at I don't know. The contemporary isn't my my theme. Yeah, I mean, we're not into like we like the Polynesian. Not into <laughs> old timey stuff. <laughs> All right. Do you have a quiz? I do have a quiz. All right. All right. It's the where do you find quiz. Oh, yeah, I like this. Okay. I'm excited about this. You excited? I am. All right. Where on Disney World property, now this is only from Disney World property, and you have to be specific, where would you find the kitchen sink? At Beaches and Cream. I like this quiz. Yes. Good job. Fantastic. The kitchen what is sink? The kitchen sink? Can you that call is, them? That is three different kinds of ice cream. Mm -hmm. Is it chocolate, vanilla, and Neapolitan? Yes, I believe so. With... 
Oh my god, everything, what's on it? Everything. Every topping they have yeah. in the house. You can, I think you can change the ice cream they said. You can interchange it to what you want it. Yeah. If you want it, like Oreo or something. But yeah, it's huge. It's insane. Nope. I think we should get it one day with the kids. Maybe one day we'll get the kitchen sink, but okay. I don't know about I don't that. Know. I feel like we need we'll more see. people to eat it. I feel like four is not even. I've seen that thing. It's enormous. It's pretty nice. I can't even imagine. And they actually give you like a kitchen sink bowl to eat it from. Yeah, it's got a faucet and everything. It's kind of Do you get to keep it? I think you do. No, you do not. Really? Because I've seen people with their kitchen sink. You probably have to pay an extra price. There probably is. Yeah. Because I've seen like postings like, what do we do with our kitchen sink? <laughs> Now that we're home, like... Don't buy it. <laughs> Candy dish. Just an idea. All right, you ready for the next one? I'm ready. Where would you find the macaron ice cream sandwich? I... France Pavilion? Yes, the French oh, yeah. Pavilion in the La Tizan de Glace. Wow. Which is like the ice cream, the ice cream shop at the French Pavilion. Oh, yeah. We haven't eaten there yet. No, we haven't. We almost did, but we decided not to go. Yeah. I want it someday. I want to get the macaron ice cream sandwich. It looks good. Cool. Kids will probably love that because yeah, they love sure macarons. They yeah, it'd probably be great. All right, you got two for two, babe. I dig it. Doing good. Good job, Bernie. Number three, where would you find pineapple bread pudding? At Ohana. Yes, you're doing great with this. Three for three. These are all things that I've eaten or want to eat. Yes. So I'm excited. Can you explain what that is? The I don't even really know what that is. It's like baked bread with pineapple, right? Oh my god, it's so amazing. Banana, caramel sauce poured all over. They pour it like I fresh. I don't like, like it. I mean, it's good, really? but I can't. No, it's too sweet for me. Oh, I love it so much. I can eat like two bites every time we go, but I'm like, no. It's always my favorite part of, of the family style dinner at Ohana. Definitely. Hmm. Although, I don't know. Close second is the noodles. The noodles are my favorite. And the chicken wings are really oh, good the, too. The pot and stickers. The, uh, and the shrimp oh. and the beef and the chicken. Like everything at Ohana is really good. It's just so good. It's the best place. But that's the dessert you get. It's All amazing. right. All right, number four. Mm -hmm. Where would you find school bread? Oh, school bread is in Norway. Good job. Do you know the name of the restaurant? I don't. I don't either. I just put Norway. The, fjord, <laughs> the Fjordenspiken. Yeah. That's the one. Um, so this, I always hear such amazing things about this school bread, but I can't have it because it has coconut on it. I'm like, yeah. And I don't like bread or school, so I can't have it either. <laughs> I can't have it. I'm I allergic. can't have it. I'm allergic to school. Yeah, super allergic to school. This is so good. Number five. All right, where would you? I've been dying to try this. I think you probably want to try it too. Where would you find the sweet and spicy chicken waffle? Sweet and spicy chicken waffle. The sandwich, the chicken waffle sandwich. Oh, I don't know anything about that. Yes, you do. Maybe I do. America, Japan. It's not in Epcot. It's in Magic Kingdom. Oh. I'll give you a hint. It's at Is Magic, it in Magic Kingdom. Kingdom. Yes, Magic Kingdom. Is that at Jungle Jungle Cruise, the Skipper's Canteen? No. Who, where is it? Really? It's at the Sleepy Hollow Cafe. At, Ma at Magic Kingdom. Oh. Sleepy Hollow. You know that, you know, right before. No, I know where it is. Right before you can go out over the, yeah. Yeah, I don't think we've ever really got anything there. Like, Never maybe. even stopped. I think we got in line for something and then it was too long, so we left. Yeah, it's usually a really long line when we Oh, go we got there. coffees there, I think, once. Maybe. Did we? Yeah, but I've always wanted to try this. It's like a, a, the chicken sandwich and the waffle. Mm -hmm. It looks so good. Huh. Spicy chicken sandwich, sweet. Oh, looks so good. I want to try it. All right, you got one wrong. I'm into it. Let's go so, try right, it. You're four to five. All right. Where would you find the zebra domes? The zebra domes. Yeah. You don't know what the zebra dome is? What's a zebra dome? It's like the little pastry that has the zebra stripes on it. It's like a chocolate cookie cake. I don't eat cookies. Why do you ask me about the cookies? I, I don't even like care about famous, those. Well, think about it. Zebra dome. Well, it's probably at Animal Kingdom. Yeah. Lodge. Yes. The Animal Kingdom Lodge at the Mara and also at, um, they serve it at Boma. Boma. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. I'll give it to you. Ask me about the good stuff. <clears throat> All right. What about number seven? LeFou's Brew. Ooh, LeFou's Brew. Yeah. Where would you get LeFou's Brew? Um, our friends, Wonderful World of Walt, they actually just made LeFou's Brew on their channel. So check them out if you want to see how to make it because they, it looks good. I, we've never tried it, but it looks amazing. Where do you find LeFou's Brew? Think about Beast it. Beast Castle? No. no. So I'll give you one more guess. France Pavilion? No. Where? At Gaston's Tavern. Oh. At Fantasyland. That kind of that kind of makes sense, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, it does. <laughs> I was I was thinking too hard. That's another one we've never been in there. Mm -mm. Ever. We need to go there. No, I've been in there. I got 
Oh, we got water. I got water. Yeah, that doesn't count. <laughs> but I fit in. Okay, we have to go in there and get the cinnamon bun. I, I hear it's good there. Okay, I won't eat that. Brew. I won't eat that, but that sounds great. We'll take a bite of it. You'll love it. I guess so. What's you next? Get that one. What what tasty treat is next on the menu? Corn dog nuggets. It's another thing I want to try. Oh, I do know where those are, but I don't know where those are. Hmm. Oh, yes, you do. Where are the corn dog nuggets? We've been here before. I know we have. Are they at Pecos Bill? No. Are they at Flame Tree Barbecue? One more guess. Ah, I don't know where that. You have to know where these are. Corn so what, dog what, nuggets. Woody's lunchbox. Corn dog nuggets. Slinky dog dash. Casey's Corner. Oh, ah. again, I'm thinking too hard. Yeah, you are. Dog. Overthinking it. Oh, baby, I don't know if you're gonna win this prize. Oh, well, if you don't give me the prize. <laughs> I don't play that way. All right, number nine. Okay. Where would you get the baked mac and cheese with pulled pork? Baked mac and cheese with pulled pork. Wow, that sounds really good right now. It is. <sighs> and it's really good from this place that we love. Is it at Captain Cook's? No. I didn't think so. That wasn't my answer. Okay. I was just, test I was just testing you. C-O. <laughs> <laughs> Car, you have any plans tonight? <laughs> Uh, not Captain Cook's. That's yeah, no. that's the wrong place. Pulled pork, barbecue pulled pork. A flame tree barbecue. Yes. Bam. Yes, of course. All right, number ten. Where would you find the PB and J milkshake? This one might be hard. We've never been here. We want to go here. PB and J milkshake. This is a very famous milkshake that you can only find at this place. Who serves milkshakes? Think about it. More foods I don't eat. It's like a. What kind of places serve milkshakes? Ice cream places. Yeah. Or awesome. milk places. What, where's the closest milk place in <laughs> What Disney else World? serves milkshakes? Milkshakes. Like, think about back in the day. Oh, is it Primetime Cafe? Yes! Good job! Wow! Yeah. I bet you would love that, actually. You love peanut butter. Um, I do, but not jelly. I know, but I hear it's really good. I'm allergic to peanut butter. I hear good things about jelly. <laughs> <laughs> jelly. <laughs> Sounds so good. Oh, no jelly. All right, and the bonus, you ready? You have to name all the places that you can get a Dole Whip on Disney World property. Aloha Isle. Yep. And the place at the Polynesian. The Pineapple Nye. Yes. Okay. Is there, there is, another one? There is. There's a few more. Oh, I don't like Dole Whips either. So I'm going to give you a hint. There are. They do serve alcoholic Dole Whips at some places. Ooh. Can you think of at least one place they serve an alcohol? Trader Sam's. Yes. The Spiky Pineapple. Oh yeah. How have I never gotten that? I wonder. I don't know. I don't like Dole Whips. I even wrote that. How have I not gotten that? <laughs> she really did write that. <laughs> um, also, apparently they serve um, a Dole Whip mimosa Ooh, at Wine Bar George that in Disney Springs. Good. Only during their brunch. And also they have it at the Tamu Tamu at Animal Kingdom. The Tamu Tamu Bar, the refreshment port, with, but it has rum. I would drink that with rum. I would so drink that. That's All right, give me the prize. All right. I won. You did good. I did great. I got like three of them. Three of them? And then you get three prizes. Oh, wow. It's just a whole bunch of beef jerky. I did what I could. Hey, you know what, man? You know, look at them now. We got it. I'm excited for the sweet and hot. This is the one I'm oh, excited for. Sriracha. Have you ever tried that? Nope. And we got the teriyaki. Yeah. I love it. You happy? I'm thrilled. I'm sorry I, I couldn't get jerky. you something Disney. I just. They don't sell that at We're taking Shaw's. a break. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. It's so hard to get stuff it now. It is hard. We're just getting stuff as we can. Yeah. But this is a great prize, and I'm really excited about Good. it. Good. I'm glad. I didn't get you jerky last show, so this right. is to make up for it. That's okay. I like it. Good. Cheers. <gasps> you are done your drink, sir. Sorry. Bernie. Wow. Bernie likes the... Bernie drinks too much. Hakuna Matata. Next week, Kevin, he'll be a little shyer. Oh, okay. That's good to know. Mm -hmm. So that's it. Yeah. Thanks for joining us. And uh, don't forget to schedule your fast passes. Every time I say it, I'm so sad. We need to come up with a different ending. Don't forget to check when Disney might be open. <laughs>